In this video, I am going to talk about how you can interpret regression results based on different models. Before I start, you should know what is regression analysis. Regression analysis is a set of statistical processes for estimating the relationships between a dependent variable and one or more independent variables. Let's say y is a dependent variable and x is a independent variable and both are continuous variables and d is a dummy variable. In the model, first model, uh, if you want to regress y on x, then you need to interpret your results like that. A1 unit change in x leads to a beta unit change in y. In the second model, if you want to regress natural log of y on the natural log of x, then you need to interpret your coefficient like that. One unit, um, one percent change in x leads to a beta percent change in y. In the third model, you want to estimate the relationship between your dependent variable y and your independent variable now, uh, the natural log of x, then the explanation of your regression result will be a 1% change uh, in x leads to a beta times 1 by 100 unit change in y. Model 4 describe the relationship between log of y and your independent variable x. Then the explanation for your regression results is that a one unit change in x leads to a beta times 100% change in Y. In the fifth model, um, your uh, independent variable is now a dummy variable. Uh, then you, you should, and you want to regress um, your independent variable Y on your, the dummy, independent dummy variable D, uh, then you should interpret your results like that. Uh, dummy equaling one leads to a beta unit change in Y. Now in the sixth model, your dependent variable is a natural log of Y and independent variable is a dummy variable. And you want to run the regression, um, then uh, your results, uh, the interpretation of your results will be uh, D equaling one leads to A 100 times exponent of beta, beta minus one 
change in y. In the last model, now your dependent variable is a dummy variable and you want to regress the dummy variable on uh, the independent variable x, then the interpretation of your results will be a one unit change in x leads to a beta times 100 change in the probability of um, uh, that uh, dummy equal one. I think um, this video might help you guys to understand how you can interpret your coefficient or your regression results after run a regression. Um, thank you so much for watching. Um, bye.